tell me, is there anything worse than a guest walking off the set in a huff? Yes, a guest walking off the set in a huff and not being able to get out of the studio. That's what happened the last time Shannon Tweed was here with her now new husband, Gene Simmons. And they're back on my show for the first time since Shannon told Gene to kiss off that day. Welcome back, the stars of Gene Simmons, <laughs> family, value, family jewels, Gene Simmons and Shannon mm. Tweed. Hi, guys. How are you? I've missed you. Where have you been? We've missed you, too. I was trapped. You trapped me like a rodent. I know. It was so... <laughs> I mean, it sort of interfered with the drama of the moment when you couldn't get out of here. <laughs> it, was, it was like my life, though. It was so... <laughs> <laughs> what did you... I, want, I have to ask you, what, after you left the studio that day and you then got together again, what did you talk about? Did you talk about... We didn't, we didn't have sex, that's for sure. <laughs> I'm sure you never did that, that day, but what did you have? What was your conversation like at that point? Um, my conversation was... My part of the conversation was... I, you know, I didn't think that was uh, a funny joke. I didn't think it was worth joking about. I don't see how you could joke about that. To yeah. me, it wasn't funny. I know. You, so that was real, right? You know, the usual. People, some people have a, a said um, that they yeah. thought it was staged. I'm not a drama queen. I'm not known for uh, being a drama queen, really. No, no. Every, everything you saw was real. By the way, I have not had a chance to say a word from all this. So you girls just continue. Get used to it. <laughs> well, we'll get to I'll you. I'll just... Uh, we'll get to you, Jane. Mm -hmm. Because I, I heard all that right. you, um, you got married. You guys get married. What Wait, not before you. No, I got <clears> married <throat> in August. When did you... What was your date? Uh, October, October 1st. first. So, Gene, what made you decide to finally, you know, bite the bullet? You know, the God's honest truth is I didn't want to lose her. She put up with so much of my crap for 28 years. Yeah. Uh, brought, up two, brought up two amazing kids. And, you know, uh, the, the same thing that made me <coughs> strong and succeed in business and in rock and roll and all that stuff, this kind of arrogant, stubborn headstrong guy where nothing stops him also never really wanted to answer the question where are you going where am I going you know it's like who wants to know and and you know uh, left with the uncertainty of whether or not I'd spend the rest of my life alone and pathetic and, no. and like a caricature of what you're supposed to be I looked around me and realized that there's only one person who, you know who loves me Aww. top to bottom with my faults and uh, it's a, you know, at some point, it's probably time to grow up. Very and, good, Jean. Uh, Very good. Is that all? Does that all break your? <laughs> does that touch you, Shannon? Of course. It yeah, does. but you know, I'm the I'm the only one that really knows what's inside there. So I mean, you know, I've had people say, "Why are you? Why do you stay with him? Why are you? Why are you doing that to yourself?" And it's, you know, it's not anything I feel I need to explain to anyone. Uh, but I know who he is, and I like who he is. 